Okay, cool. No, the introduction is okay. Oh, okay. Yeah, introduction is okay. You're good to go? Okay. My name is Theo Baloyi, the founder of Batu, and I'm a small giant. Hi, I'm Posha Mgomezolo, founder of Posha M Skin Solutions. I am a small giant. Hi, my name is Brett Thompson, and I'm the co-founder and CEO of New Form Foods, and I am a small giant. Mr. Tony Rims, I'm the founder and CEO of Wisola, and I'm a small giant. I'm Justine Parodia, co-founder and COO at New Form Foods, and I'm a small giant. Is Porsche M a homegrown brand? Proudly so. It's definitely a homegrown brand. What makes it a homegrown brand? It's an African brand, um, born in Africa, using ingredients, made in Africa for all Africans under the African sun. New Form Foods was uh, born between Centurion and Cape Town during COVID. We were in lockdown, we couldn't leave the home, so we were very homegrown. When we... <laughs> the fact that we, we innovate, we, we're a company that just doesn't know rules, uh, well we know rules, but we know how to work um, in a way that gets things done. And we were determined to start this company. I mean, there's a few things uh, that really inspired me to start but you know, One was um, I myself am a product of opportunity, you know, an accountant by profession. And I had a privilege of working for one of the top four accounting firms, not only in South Africa, but abroad. You know, and oftentimes when I came back home, home being Alex, I would realize that a lot of people in my community are unemployed and predominantly the youth, you know, they've lost hope as well. So oftentimes, you know, I went back to people that have, you know, given me opportunities that have paid the way for me to express a sense of gratitude. That was met by one big ask, that Theo, we don't want anything from you, just pay it for it in your own way. If you, you know, if there's someone out there who wants to start their own journey in the entrepreneurial space, yeah. what, what would you say to encourage them and to get them to keep going? Yeah, I don't know if I'm going to encourage anybody because it's really a very difficult path. You know, because it's not um, it's not a sh it's not a sprint. It's a long it's a long run. The biggest thing that I give advice to is just do it. I think the biggest thing that I struggled with, and I think a lot of people struggle with, is actually the confidence to go and do something in spaces where you're largely uncomfortable. I think imposter syndrome is really big. I think you'd find that a lot of people struggle to actually just get going, and if you Take it, break it up into small pieces and just start doing the small things towards it. You'd find that you're probably 10 times ahead of anyone else anyways because so many people struggle to even start. Yeah.